Hello everyone. So welcome back to the next video that how to update your Vidwan ID. जैसे कि हमने पहले ही वीडियो में देखा था कि Vidwan ID बनाना बहुत सिंपल है. Few steps आपको follow करना था. Immediately आपको Vidwan ID मिल जाता है. ठीक है. But the moment you log in to the profile, you can see your profile score is uh, not 10. And unless and until it is 10, it is not active. Okay. So I'll just show you. The moment I click on my Vidwan ID, I get the remark uh, like this that my profile is not activated by the Vidwan administrator because the detail is not completed. So to activate my in, uh, Vidwan ID, I have to click on uh, update my profile. Okay. So you have to update the information like uh, the personal information. First is expertise. Click on add expertise you have to these are these eight areas given by the as per the web of science uh, uh, domain so you have to select uh, the areas for which you belong to so like the engineering pharmacy people can select medical and health sciences and architecture people can select the arts and humanities as i belong to the library science field i will select the social science select the expertise so my subjects will be there Library information side. You can write the brief uh, info about your expertise, like the mm -hmm. I'll just type few. Okay, and then save. Uh, next comes the email information. So, edit the information if you want to change the email information i'll keep this same as an institutional email id next come the personal information mrs select the title date of birth gender Save it. Contact information. See the moment I keep on saving this, this criteria will change. Nine eight. Street name and the address. So I'll type the college address over here. Select the country state select city very good pin code is six Okay, if there is any web URL, you can give it. And that way I can save the changes. Okay, so this is done. Come to the experience part of it. Select the institute name. Karsinga Technical Campus, Department is Central Library. Select the designations. Month, the date when you joined the institute. I am currently working. So this way I by clicking on add you can add your previous uh, experiences educational qualification on uh, take the one university of mumbai as if 
your institute's name is not there, just click on add the institute. Subject is science. Passing year 2000. Right? And I save it. Okay. If there is any honors at the award, that doctoral thesis, if you have a membership of any this thing, professional bodies, just add like this. Okay. Publication, you can add manually. You can import the CSV file or the big text file. Okay. Or you can also uh, connect your other identity suppose uh, i have a orchid id so i'll first i'll open my orchid id so this is my orchid id i'll just copy it and update my orchid id okay if you have a scopus id if you have publication in scopus uh, you will have a scopus id open your scopus account copy the uh, scopus id and then paste it Researcher ID, Pablo's ID, Google Scholar ID. How uh, to get this Google Scholar ID? First, to open your Google Scholar account. See, you have to open your Google Scholar account. Okay. Click on my profile. See, I'm logging to my Google Scholar account. I'll click on my profile. The moment you click on a profile, you can see the address over you. See, user is equal to. So, this is after this is equal to this is your username. So just copy this and paste it here and save. Now it will fetch the data from your uh, other academic identity profile, like this publications and all. This is fetched through my other profiles. Okay. So this way you have to update your profile. So just update your profile and see, uh, make sure that this is green. Thank you for watching. Now you can see I have updated my profile. If you want to update anything else, just click on add or edit the informations. Personal information, everything I have updated. Even my other academic identity, qualifications publications everything i have updated uh, now i'll close my account and within 24 hours it will take 24 hours uh, to in play with one people to update your activate your with one id thank you for watching now i'll request all the researchers community to please create your with one id and get yourself connected to the researchers community thank you